What is up you guys, it's Violet Telly here and welcome back to Let's Get Revive. Now, I hope you're feeling great, feeling amazing, feeling vibe. As you guys can see, tonight's item shot would have taken us from the Tuesday, the 14th of May into the early Wednesday morning of the 15th of May. So, in obviously, I'm assuming in collaboration with obviously Marvel and Disney and also, you know, X-Men 97 literally popping off. We have the return of some X-Men items. So, we have Rogue and Gambit's bundle. I have already covered this in its own is or isn't that worth it bundle video on my YouTube, not TikTok, but YouTube. But if you guys do want me to do one, I will do one on there. Moving this up. Pardon, we've got the gliders for the Rogue and Gambit bundle. We've got the Suit Surfer. The Suit Surfer. The Ace is wild. Again, like, this is just awesome. Moving us on, we also have the Blackbird Glider. Scott knows we're borrowing this, right? <laughs> yeah, I don't think Scott knows you're borrowing it, but pretty cool. Moving us on to the return of the Dark Phoenix bundle, or like skin showcase. It also does come with its own um, loading screen as well. The closer to the flame, the longer the sh dr the longer your shadow becomes. Oh, the Wrath of the Phoenix. Jeez. Very, very cool. Again, I've covered that before. As well as the Psylocke skin comeback. You guys know she's usually part of the X-Force set. But now she's on her own for a little bit. Moving us on to the Future War bundle still with us. We have the Billie Eilish. Um, Red Roots Billie Eilish, I call her. Bundle still with us. I have covered this in its own. Is it, is it not worth it? Bundle video on TikTok and YouTube. We've also got the Royale bundle still with us. We've still got the My Hero Academia collaboration we've got part three we've got part one part two ish now this is part of part one as well wasn't it in chapter four season one we've got some um emotes and some harvesting tools we've also got the part twos which is really really cool definitely recommend grabbing these moving us on to the fncs chapter five season two bundle we have the fns F FNCS Chapter 5 Season 1 bundle, but tonight we have returned the FNCS Global Championship 2023 bundle. Man, did not expect to see all these FNC FNCS bundles in the item shop. But anyway, really, really cool. Again, I have covered all of these in their own Is It Not Worth It bundle video on YouTube and TikTok. Moving us on to the signature styles for tonight, we have the return of the Odyssey skin, which is the pretty much a ranked up skin. Um, her skin styles will change the, the higher your rank in uh, Fortnite ranked. We've got the Bonnie World. If you guys know, we had the male introduced or returned recently, the Leon. We've got the Athleisure Assassin. We all know about her. We've got the Nightbeam skin. We all know about her. We've got the Guild. We've got the Fate skin. We've got the Rough Raiders bundle. Really, really cool little bundle that is. Moving us on, we've got the return of the Velocity skin. Oh, my goodness, apologies. We've got the Velocity skin. Now, this used to be legendary. I don't think it is anymore. Anyway, we've got the Royal Air Force Flying Ace. First introduced in OG Season 9. We've got the default. We then also have the Flight Mare style, which looks absolutely awesome. Also suits the um, purple style for the Hades Batling. Just want to point that out. Moving this onto the Velocity Lego style, which looks very, very cool as well. First time I'm seeing this, actually. Moving us on to the back bling, we have the Bomber Bag, High Flying. Again, got some nice little cute provisions in there. Moving us on to the Grim Fable skin, we have Once Upon a Time. Obviously, you guys know this is based off, or literally is, um, Little Red Riding Hood, but obviously grown up, a bit more badass. So we've got the default here. Oh, sorry, I have the alternate equipped. Where this is the default, where she literally has the uh, wolf as a hat, shall we say. Moving us on to the alternate, we have the no hat style, which I do like this one a little bit more because it gives it like the Chun Li buns. Moving us on to the Lego style, we have the Grim Fable. This is the first time I've seen this as well, which again, it looks absolutely awesome. Moving us on to the pack leader back bling, the packs got your back. Really, really cool. Moving us on to the Fox Fire skin, we have Face the Threat Head On. Part of the Honor B set, first introduced in Chapter 3, Season 3. We have the default here. We also have the Helmet style, which you can have equipped. I don't know, it looks a bit weird on him. Looked okay on the female skin. Moving that off, we also have the Glow Off as well. But then we can have the Glow On, which does look really, really cool. Moving this on to the Lego style, which looks, looks fire. Absolutely love this. Really, really cool Lego style. 
Moving us on to the Mel skin, we have Mel in the mix and on the hunt. I really love this skin, but it's just a shame she doesn't come with anything. But eh, overall, I think she's really, really cool. Love the fact that she's got like a spade on her um, right sleeve there. Really, really cool. Moving us on to the Lego style for the Mel. This is the first time I've seen this as well. And it looks really, really cool. Moving us on to the Big Bad Axe Harvesting Tool. We have the Better to Chop You With. Let's see this ring animation. Oh, oh. this looks like it'd be good enough for like a mythic in a Halloween season. That would be dope. Moving us on, we have the Scarlet and Sai Pickaxe and Backbling combination. So first off, we've got the Scarlet Sai. The perfect balance of elegance and offense. So we've got the default. We then also have the alternate style, which is the Viridian style. Looks amazing. We also have the back bling, which is the Scarlet Sai. It pretty much does have the same description. So we've got the default, and then we've got the Viridian um, size. Now, if you have if you have the back bling equipped and the harvesting tool, you could unsheath the harvesting tool from the back bling. I always love these. Moving us on to the flipping incredible emote. Flex on them. Sorry, flip on them. Flex on them. First introduced in the OG Season 5. Moving us on to the rest of the item shop. We have the level up quest pack, guys. As you guys can see, I have fully unlocked all the quests for the level up quest pack. I have the alternate style equipped, which is the story hero um, Perseus. Again, you guys will have until May 23rd to get all these quests done, but you just go around the map and collect level up tokens. Really, really cool. We do also have alternate style where you can have the hell helmet off. But I like it with the full helmet on. Really, really cool. So again, these are the items you get. I have already covered these in their own Is It Isn't That Worth It bonus video up on TikTok and uh, YouTube. But yeah, moving us on. Again, you'll have until the 23rd of May to get these. So my bets probably get to like May 23rd, 20th, just in case. Anyway, moving us on, we've got the Star Wars collaboration still with us. Again, these will be with us for a little bit longer. Oh damn, press the wrong button. Uh, moving us on to the Lego kits. We also have the return of the Golden King himself, Ascendant Midas. Man, this has got to be one of the badass things from this season. It's got to be one of the best things from this season. Midas officially returned. Moving us on to the Silence is Golden Bundle, where we have the dynamic hush skin. I have already covered this in its own Is What Is It Not Worth It bundle video as well. We have Rufus, or as I like to call him, the Trash Panda. Because he literally looks like a trash panda. He's got a trash panda t-shirt on. But yeah, really, really cool. Moving us on to the accessories for our uh, Rocket Racing. We also have the Sentio bundle still with us. Moving us on to the gear for the festival. Where we have what I like to call the Sun Worshippers items. Ooh, ooh. We've got the Toss-Up Emote. Give it a spin. Hey, that is sick. Moving us on to some jam tracks. We've got some absolute bangers in here. We had some new ones recently. Moving us on to the bottom, we have the Anarchy Acres Lego kit return along with the Grimbles. Moving us on to the Fortnite Passes and Crew. And then we have the special offers and bundles. So yeah, nothing new tonight, but we do have some absolute bangers in the Fortnite item shop. 100% recommend grabbing these. But yeah, overall, hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to smash that like button. If you didn't enjoy the video, let me know in the comments down below why you like the video. Also, let me know. Um, with us being 10 days away from the end of Chapter 5 Season 2, what are you going to miss and why? Also, if you are new to the channel and you guys um, are subscribed, if you are, guys are subscribed, subscribe to the channel if you're new and join to me. Let's catch a vibe. Also, if you are new, please don't forget to switch in the bell notifications. You get no follow from that load. But more importantly, then I'm going to say, b -b 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 and I'll catch you guys next time. Peace.